Hi guys, how are you doing? I haven't posted for a while and something has been uh, on during this month. As you see from my previous video, it was like uh, last winter. I painted my bike, you know, if you follow the series, you know by now that um, I like to change the color of the bike um, almost every year. Um, using like a plastic dip, it's like a vinyl spray. And this year I also changed it already again. And I have to say it's probably the best uh, combination uh, that I did, you know, I did the, the green one, which is very nice. Last year was like a um, gold. Didn't turn. I wanted to do it like yellow, bright, but I mixed it up, and I messed up the, the base color underneath. It was a bit too dark. Uh, this year it was really really good. It's like a, a red with uh, some metallic flakes. Probably you don't see it in the camera. Um, just a couple of things, it's gonna be a, quite a quick video. Um, I'm probably gonna have a new bike. <laughs> I went to make a test ride for a new bike this week and I'm like uh, trying to figure out um, what to do. I've got a choice of two bikes, one is uh, red, one is grey. The red one has got a special um, exhaust already which is gonna cost a little bit so i'm not sure if i'm gonna go, go for stock but um, i don't want to talk about it yet because i'm like uh, very you know careful i don't want to talk too much before actually buying it um i just want to give you a little bit of an advice uh, because uh, usually you know i use this plastic dip but you can full, uh, you know, pl full deep, plastic deep, they're all kind of the same material. And it was very, very delicate to work, you know, and you, you can scratch it with your legs. And it was very, very delicate. Uh, this year, I changed a little bit uh, um, the system. And I find it, it is actually very much more uh, stable. Uh, so I did, I did coats, as usually, uh, the plastic deep. Um, or full dip uh, that you can peel it off again but uh, after it I actually use the normal uh, product so like this one car paint you know if you put this one straight on your bike you cannot remove it of course this is a proper paint uh, but uh, I put it uh, on uh, like the full dip uh, the same color and then I put this one on top and then I put uh, like a transparent on top and it got very much more uh, hard. So less delicate than uh, the full dip. So my suggestion is if you want to do your bike or whatever, give it like a three, four coats of uh, full dip and then on top uh, one or two coats of a uh, normal uh, metallic or normal color and you and then a, on top knock a transparent and you will find it that it's more more uh, much more resistant so this is actually probably the last video with this bike i did it 25600 kilometers in five years never had any problem so i can really recommend uh, this bike if you want something fun uh, light of course the engine is just uh, one cylinder but you know 44 uh, ps 44 uh, hp for such a small engine it's really a very good very good motor um yeah of course it's not made for uh, longer trips um but you know i did some my journeys you know this year i went to italy again through Switzerland, so I did like six, seven hundred kilometers in one day. Uh, of course, it's not ideal, but uh, it's you know, it's a fun drive. Yeah, don't know if you want to try to think what I'm gonna buy next. Maybe you can write a comment. 
and um, I will let, let you post it as soon as I've got it at home and it's gonna be probably something unusually not the same kind of bike much different uh, the engine is gonna be about um, three times as big so um, it's gonna be red probably and um, yeah you can try to write a, a comment and write what you think that it's gonna be so this is the place for the new bike i hope that they will fit it but i think and yeah it was um, much fun to have you know i don't want to sell it really but uh, i got a good deal on this bike um, but you know it's every time they go in the garage and i see it it's I still like it very very much so it's not like I want to sell it but it's a pity to have both you know in the ideal world you just keep this one stored but what can you do with it you know it's my first bike you know, it's always gonna be in my heart and I let somebody else enjoy it okay see you guys